champion we remain here shake my hand i appreciate that it's j black ak black man first and foremost cassidy versus hitman hollow was a very entertaining battle um i appreciate it that I, I i in certain points i like chaos shout out to kid chaos we got a video about that uploaded too too as long as you know they don't fight if a main event is entertaining in, in a good or a bad way i'm appreciative you know what i mean i feel like i got what i got out of the battle and, and for the most part i'm happy with it so let's break down i'm, I'm gonna call these the start offs there's a lot of narratives going into the battle Everybody stay stand to stay tuned and stand patient. I got y'all. I got y'all. It's gonna it's gonna all make sense. Uh, the narratives was Cassie would not get booked again after this. That's what Hitman said. Shout out to Hitman. We are gonna break in this whole battle. Cassidy will be booked again. I want to see Cassidy again. Cassidy is in fact the energy. Let's let's not get that let's not get that misconstrued. You know, recaps are doing quadruple quintuple. 10 times the amount, you know, we got, we, we recapped them every battle in the car, but the Cassidy versus Hitman Holla is doing over 200. I think it's for a lot of people. I'm checking Hip Hop is real. I'm checking 15 Minutes of Fame, 200, 200. So Cassidy is that wave. He's bringing in eyes to battle rap. I appreciate that. So Cassidy will be booked again. Uh, Cassidy did not get bodied. Um, and I think that's, that, 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 that's the goal, right? So if you don't body him, you're going to face this type of critique and this type of criticism regarding the battle. So I want to say that right there. Cassidy will be booked again. You know what I mean? A lot of battle rappers saying they can beat Cassidy. I think that's the main argument right there. I'll, I'll still be Cassidy. So so the Cassidy next battle, probably end of this year or next year, he can come back and get a, yet another bag. He was not stopped in his tracks. You know what I mean? So battle rappers, the next battle rapper to face Cassie. Shh. Shh. Just battle. Be quiet. Battle. Don't don't raise the stakes. Don't move the goalposts on your side so high. They expect nothing from Cassidy. They expect you, the battle rapper, to body him in the crowd. So when you don't do that, this is what happens, ladies and gentlemen. They, they, they consider you Superman, and they consider him an ant going into the fight. So if Superman doesn't fly down and crush the ant, that's on you. And y'all building up as like, ah, three of them, I body him, I do him very bad. That's what happens. So anything that's happening online, that's kind of the narrative that y'all set. Just saying. Just saying. But with that being said, can we get into the battle? Without me, screw, you know, Messing your opinions up. I'm going to let y'all vote before we even start, before I even say a word about the first rounds. Y'all vote first. All right, y'all getting ready to vote? We good to go? And then I'm going to break down a round. Just to be fair, right? They're going to say, I'm going to be fair. So first round, Cassidy wins. Hitman wins. Run it up, run it up, run it up, run it up. Who won the first round between Hitman Holla and Cassidy? And if you're on the YouTube comments, post right now. Post right now. Post right now. Post right now. We got a lot of people in here. Don't do me like this. I got a lot of people in here. I got a lot. Of, I, don't, I need more. I got way more people than that in here. I have way more people than that in here. I, can you vote, please? Can y'all vote, please? I have, I have like, I have way, I have way more people than that in here right now. That's voting right now. Can y'all vote, please? Come on, come on, don't do this. Get some more cash people in here. Get some more cash people in here, please. What are we doing? Okay, is that the vote? Can, can, I, can I stop my breakdown of the first round? Because I'm not going to agree with y'all vote. I'm just letting y'all know. Y'all vote is y'all vote. I'm, I'm going to do my thing. We good? Not everyone's seen it. Y'all act like everybody's seen it. Gosh. You know what I mean? So it is what it is. A vote is a vote. All right. I'm seeing 152 for Cassidy, uh, Hitman 204. But then again, they battle on a whole different platform. So I, but I'm not going to agree with everything. I'm not going to agree with all, all, all the, uh, the votes, whatever. So now it's going away. It's pretty much 150 to 200. 
in favor of Hitman Holler. But that's just them voting. I'm going to break down the battle now. Uh, the first round. From Hitman Holler, the COVID-19 had to check his temperature before he came in. Thought that was a cool opener. I was going to let him hear rounds from a calico. I was returning the favor. Thought that was dope. You know what I mean? Okay. Who y'all prefer? A nigga that's going to start a fight or a nigga that's going to end it? I thought that was dope. The uh, Petty and Bada Publishing. I thought that was cool. Come to my hotel living the one. I thought that was cool. Uh, shoot while he's still, whip's still spinning. And Super Mario. I thought that was dope. I, pref I would rather he remix something else. But he remixed that. I thought that was dope for the crowd. I wasn't super crazy off of it, but I thought that was dope. Uh, I thought the goods Arsenal did. I'm judging off your last forecast. I thought that was fire. The next day air, I thought that was cool. Last time they ever give Cass a roll. Dope. I take him back. I take him back to the early days when I put him to sleep. Now dream Cass. I thought that was fire. I thought that would have uh got a remix. <laughs> You know, he shot the hit, but I thought that would have got a remix to Dreamcast. I thought that was hot for me. For me personally, it's my opinion that we're doing right now. Um, thank you. Shiva said Dreamcast was crazy. To me, it was. I like the Dreamcast. That was fire to me. The Ben Simmons in Philly, you was no, you was not a shooter. Come on. It was fire, but don't be petty with us, people. Don't come on, bro. Don't do that. Don't do that, man. That was fire, though. The cash straight set up in, you know, middle segment. The whole segment was fire to me. It was dope. Uh, we don't even know if Cash straight. I forget he delusion. That's a Cash straight. And I thought this was hard. I'm Steph Curry, not because I be thirty in niggas. It's because my little brother is a shooter as well. I thought that was fire. Thought that was fire. That could have got a remix too. Oh my god. Hitman Holly chose the Super Mario, which was you know which was good. But those last two lines I said was fire. Probably deserved that remix. But I, I guess you wanted to save show out for the end. Okay, makes sense. I ain't mad at it. And that's round one from Hitman Holler. Let's go to round one from Cassidy. The gun gets you, gun gets you, gun gets you. Okay. Before Corona, I was wearing masks, giving niggas six feet when they casket dropped. Thought that was dope from uh, Cassidy. He get hit with a combination like a master lock. Thought that was cool. Crowd gave it, you know, something... Oh my god, you know, but I, I guess I thought it was cool though. I told my I told my goons don't cry over spill milk, just get the grab the mops. Thought that was dope. The Reed had it in the car, you had it in the bag. I thought this was dope because how he was selling it after the bar. I think he should incorporate that more. He's like, look at you, hitman, you running to get your bag. Look at you. <laughs> Look at him, man, running for the bag. I thought, I thought if he would incorporate that more, but I gave him points for that. I thought that was fire. The fact that he's that comfortable on the stage now, shout out to Cassidy. I liked it. Uh, I need your two cents, not just your ears and eyes. But that was dope. He was texting John John, though, terrified. Again, like I said in the initial recap, I like the fact that he's going off about the face-off. You know he's he, he's 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 saying things that's pertinent to us, and it's not general. It's not general shit. You know what I mean it's something that we can gravitate towards, and it's direct. You know the other battles he was knocking elephants down. Now this is okay. You texting John John? No, terrified. I like the way he sold those bars right there. It's fire to me. Um, you said you said you was known you, you was known for punching niggas. I was like, where was I? I thought that was dope too. So as you can see, I'm going down a list of Cassie lines, and he he's having some dope back to back. This is probably the best we've ever seen Cassidy before, because we didn't get this respectfully. Shout out to Cass. We didn't get this in the Arsenal match. We didn't get this in the Goods match. We got this in the second round in, in the disaster battle. But we didn't get this, you know, in your last few joints. So the fact that I'm I'm quoting things back to back to back in the first, um. It's dope. And this is all before he starts to, let's get shits clarified. To get shit clarified, let's play Swear to God. I thought this segment was fire too. Um, backstage, you asked for my autograph. We found out in a tournament. We found out in the third round that he won a tournament, and that's how he got the autograph. But I, he pretty much confirmed the story in the first round, which I'm not mad at. I think it's dope. Um, 
You was you was on your grind balding, so I signed your Spalding. I like the fact that Cassidy, you know, like I, I'm I'm him. This is who I was, and he's rubbing it in. A lot of times, battle rappers can talk down to their opponents. You know, I mean, shout out to was it uh, in London? I think it's Twerk versus Arsenal. Arsenal was pretty much talking down to him. The fact that Cassidy can do this to the top level, the highest level battle rappers, it just it sits well with me. So I think he needs to do this a little bit more. I signed, I signed to Spalding. He asked for an autograph, y'all. He asked for an autograph. Y'all see this man try to pick gun for me? He asked for an autograph. I signed to Spalding. I like the way Cassie be rubbing in his lines. You know what I mean? I thought that was dope. Um, let me see. I carry rock everywhere. I traveled that. I thought that was dope. NBA instead of Beasley House. You could have been an NBA instead of Beasley House on your name on an NBA. I thought that was dope too. I think he should have ended it there. He goes on for two minutes with there's nothing for me to like really quote. It gets dry up here. I think he should have ended it. Uh, I think LTBR said his round was 12 minutes. I believe him. I believe them. Uh, this is all the first round. Wait, we're going to get to the second. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're going to get to the second. Yeah, I think the round went dry after this, and it went downhill after this. He should have left it after the Spalding segment, you know, him signing an autograph. Or he should have ended it with the, the Beasley house with your name on the ND. I thought that was dope. Ended on a high note. Yeah, yeah. But this round, to me, is debatable at best. You can really go either way. Um, If you want to knock off points for him not closing out the, the, the first round, how he should have, by just finishing. It's up to you. The first round's debatable. We'll come back to that if y'all want. The first round's debatable. And here's where I apologize to everybody. You know what I mean? Um, I had this suit on. I think the last time we was doing the recap, there was a little bit of drinks in the air. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I think our assessment, it was what it was. Um, and as we deliver this second round, I want to apologize for absolutely nothing. Wow. <laughs> I just really clickbaited that. all of you niggas. You, you think, do you think a sudden dislike is going to make me change my opinion? You must not know. I'm a nice guy, but I stand on what I say. You niggas is bugging. What? You think battle rappers, I, I logged on my Twitter today, ladies and gentlemen. You think battle rappers saying this is not going to make me change my opinion? Huh? You, you guys are bugging. Again, I, I, I get it. I'm Jay Black's nice guy, but I stand on my opinions, ladies and gentlemen. Y'all must not know. With that being said, I'm going to let y'all vote on the second round before I get into the second round. This is where it heats up. This is where it heats up. I did my due diligence. This is my third watch, ladies and gentlemen. This is my third watch. So here we go. Everybody vote right now. Are we gonna put Cassidy names first out of respect? Cassidy wins. This is this is round two. This is round two. Yeah, I'll put round two. Okay. Hitman wins round two. Vote before I go. Vote before I go. Vote before I go. Please, ladies and gentlemen. Please vote before I go. I don't want to sway y'all. They say I sway y'all. They say I sway y'all. They say I sway y'all, ladies. Come on, go ahead. I'm not. I'm not speaking one second round before until y'all go. I'm not. Come on. Yo, find the people that was disliking the video from last time so they can come vote for you. Vote for cash, please. We need. Come on. This, this is looking crazy. Everybody, come on. Come on, man. Vote. And why you missed it? Sorry. I apologize for absolutely nothing. They <laughs> think a set of comments is gonna change, maybe change what I got. You bug it. Respectfully, respectfully. And I think y'all should respect that. You know what I mean? If you can easily sway somebody off their, their position, their stance, then why would you respect their opinion like that? I'm sorry. It is what it is. We don't gotta agree every day. Like, why would I? I don't agree with Stephen A and Max Kellerman, uh, Shannon Sharp, Skip B. I don't agree with them niggas every day. Y'all bugging. Uh, see, I pretty much gave the second, if I'm mistaken, to Hitman Hollow. We're watching in the background. Uh, okay, uh, let me see here. A couple of narratives here. So, Hitman Hollow got booed before Cassidy. That is a fact. 
Hitman Holler did get booed in the second round before Cassidy did, so he technically got booed before Cassidy did. Um, Hitman Holler second round, he starts off pretty much getting booed, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so he said, stop comparing me all the pens and battle because all them niggas got a nine to five. I thought that was rubbing it in, you know what I mean? Look at you. But that wasn't really towards Cassidy. Still a cool line to me. I let I let the bow down in your temple. You better pray to your God. I thought that was cool. He got booed for that. And keep in mind when I say this too. We'll get to the crowd in a second. Hold on. Let me just go through the round real fast. Let's do our due diligence. Let's take our time with this one. Come on. They said we was drinking last time. We're going to take our time with this one. All I had today was water. We're good, ladies and gentlemen. I let that I let the bow down in your temple. You better pray to your God. People were quoting this and saying this was trash. I have no problem with that. That's you can say whatever you want about the bar. I thought the bar was cool. Cool. But it got booed. People were tweeting it. So I just want to keep that in your mind frames as we go through everybody's lines. Even Hitman's. Shout out to Hitman, but I gotta do my due diligence, sir. I gotta do what I do. Alright, uh, Twitter gangster keyboard is the only time you ever touch the pound. And he got into a scheme right there. I don't have all of it. The sneak dissing. Don't you know that talk? Taking that talk will put you in the subway, leave you underground. I thought that was dope. The layaway, the bow only came down to put something down. Only came to put something down. I thought that was cool. Uh, you was on a block in the 90s. Okay, Osa tag. I thought that was fire. Um, let me see. Uh, do the drive behind the wheel. You don't have no drive behind your wheel. You're supposed to crash. They booted and then cheered it. There was a weird thing happening in the building, I think, that we received on, you know, on the um on the playback, on the pay-per-view. Um, it was a boo win and chair. I gotta explain that to me. I don't get the boo and chairs. Like who, 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 it, there's a boo chair? There's a boo section and a chair section in the building? Am I the only one? They booed stuff and then chaired it and then booed it and then helped him run it back. Everybody apologize to Danny Myers right now. Y'all laughed at this brother when he said, do you believe in a parallel universe when there actually is one? Danny Myers, the culture owes you an apology. That crowd was literally a parallel universe. Boo! <laughs> that was fire! What? Boo! I like it! Huh? Yo, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Um, let me see. Yeah, as I put it down, they booed him repeating lines. I thought this, he had a whole segment, and he ended off with this. Uh, Blade give you a permanent smile. That'd make a joker mad. I thought that was dope. Hitman get, they said, Hitman get back and get back. Too much money in it. I thought that was fire. They booed him and then cheered him again. <laughs> help me, help me. Help me here. I thought that was, I thought that was a fire line. Uh, it reminded me the the Hitman versus K-Shine, uh, it told me, fall back on my legacy. I landed on my legacy or something like that. It's fire. Um, get it out the mud like Swamp Thing. Cool. It's a setup, so I'm not crazy about it, but set up. And it ended off with, I made something out of nothing like my offspring. Thought that was dope. Thought that was dope. And in my notes, I put it then. They, they booed and then cheered it again and repeated the line with him. So when he ran it back, the crowd is like, I made something off of nothing like, an off, like my offspring. I bet he flipped like he did the, the boxing stuff. The, that's what him and Cassie got into the, the, the air boxing, and, you know what I mean, doing this. You know, because in the promo, they, they was doing what they was doing. Then he said, uh, I bet he flipped like an acrobat. In my notes, he says, nah. Respectfully hit, man. I wasn't crazy about that one at all. Um, I told him pose. I need the eagle off top. I thought that was dope. I thought this was fire. I created a style and battle rap that you're struggling in. Mm. Mm. I need more to that. That could have been a whole angle, Hitman. That could have been a whole angle. Because that reminds me of uh, when Cassidy battled goods. You know what I mean? Say the bargain. Um, I created a style and battle rap that you're struggling in. So when goods battle uh, Cassidy, Cassidy's like, yo, you pop up something not created. It's like a flip on that. So I think, I think Hitman could expand it on that one. Um, stand on top of Cass with the AR. I'm going to do it for Ab. I thought that was cool. I thought his second round was okay. 
it wasn't his best. It's probably his worst round of the battle. Hitman's worst round. You know what I mean? Um, but they say Hitman got booed. But what they fail to tell you guys is that both these dudes got booed in the second round. And one got booed more. Let's get into it. Um, I thought this was fire from Cassidy. He should have expanded on this as well. Shout out to Cass. Your next battle, because you are going to battle again. You are going to get the, the, the bread in the bag, brother, man. I'm not going to stop your bag, Cassidy. At all. Battle again. We want you back in this culture. It's a win for everybody when you battle. Let's call it for what it is. You know what I mean? Um, but he said, I, I did shit with I did shit with Kiss, Nas, Game, and Wayne before Carter 5. Like, expand on that part. You can go in. You can have a whole 30-second segment on that, and it would have been fire. Uh, when you got them fake teeth, you should have got them in a smaller size. Fire. fire. I'm like, at this point, seeing how his Hitman second round wasn't crazy, and his first round, you can... Whatever you want with it, debatable. I'm like, is Hitman Holler really in trouble? Oh, my God. You remember that time uh, Shane Mosley uh, punched Floyd Mayweather? I felt like that. Like, oh, shit. Yes, the smallest. It was fine to me. It was fire. Yes, this is all my opinion. Respectfully, everybody in the chat. I thought it was fire. When you bought them teeth, when you fought them fake teeth, you should have got them in a smaller size. I delivered it. I liked it. Funny fire. It was funny and fire to me. It's, it's, you know, it's, it's my opinion. But like I was saying, the, the Mayweather, Shane Mosley hitting Floyd Mayweather, I believe in the second or third round, I'm like, this is happening right now. Cassidy has a leg up. No beg your pardon. They saw me in here. I don't think he's, he's out there. He's not here. Okay, cool. Um, you got a leg up on Hitman Holler right now. We're 10 seconds in. The momentum is shifting right back to Cassidy's corner. We got a battle. Do you believe? I believe right now. ARP shot the ARP. I believe right now. I believe. But with all that being said, it goes downhill from here, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just doing my due diligence. I know y'all going to like, dislike it or whatever. I got it. At the end of the day, I created a channel to get my opinion. I'm getting my opinion on this battle. It is what it is. Little Red Riding Hood scheme. The crowd booed him. It wasn't good. You were hit, man. Go holla at whoever effed your mouth up. It wasn't good. Respectfully, shout out to him, man. F your baby mom on the gram while your fans watch. I don't know why that was put there. Shout out to Cassidy. This is all out of respect. Um, I got plaques. Here we go. Here we go. He picks it back up. I got I got plaques on my wall. You got battle rap faces. That was fire. More of that. More of that. If you watch the Hip Hoppers or interview with Hitman Holly, he shows everybody from Rock, I believe, K-Shine, Sue Surf, Arsenal on his wall. So he's like, I got plaques. I got platinum plaques on my wall. You got battle rap faces. I thought that was fire. Um, Let me see here. My fists, my fists fly. They all connect like the cheapest flight. And the crowd boo respectfully. Um, I started to like his real hitman angle when he was naming the real hitmans and this and that. Until he said this. But he fixed it in the third round. So so I, I he fixed it in the third round. He fixed it in the third round. But in the second round, he said this. If you're a real hitman, name somebody you shot. If you a hitman, holla how many bodies you got. Respect to Cassidy, though. He did fix it in the third round. He fixed it in the third round. But if, my, my thing is this. If you're going to say the line that, that was so fine in the third round, this should be just exited out. This could be filtered out. This contradicts what you're saying in the third round. And what you're saying in the third round, again, was hard as shit. It was fire. This didn't need that to be here. All right. Um, let me see here. What else you got? Mm -mm -mm. Let me sure I get everything properly for for Cassidy. I'm gonna do my due diligence. The hitman theme, how many bodies you got? The man that got your shit never got hit, man. 
but your name Hitman? Nah. Brotherhood, a bunch of brothers from the hood having blank with you. Nah. And the crowd boo. Um, brother a call, brother at all, brother-in-law. No, 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 I, I, I can't, I can't. Um, we got booed again. Uh, the sticker up your brother in half. Now he'd be your half brother. Respectfully, nah. And the crowd booed again. Um, it's not happening even if you have a messy nose. This is the second round, ladies and gentlemen. See, like, this is what happens. They tell you Hitman Holla got booed, but they, they fail to tell you that Hit, uh, excuse me, Cassie got booed three times as much as Hitman in that same round. And y'all wanted me to apologize? I stand on my opinion. Y'all bugging. Y'all bugging. Y'all bugging. Y'all bugging! <laughs> oh, yeah, I, I, I get it. I'm the nice guy, but I stand on my opinion. I stand on it. I've been through I've been through this. I've been canceled 35 million times in this culture. What? Y'all don't, don't know who I am. <laughs> I get canceled every other day. Come on. You think a thousand dislikes is going to change my shit, you bucket? I just watch it again to make sure I, you know, I'm, you know, I can stand on what I'm saying. I stand on what I'm saying. All right. So like I was saying, it's, it's not, it's not happening. Even you got a messy nose. No. Um, I thought this was fire. <laughs> I after wilding out chick the first episode. Yeah, shout out to Cass. <laughs> uh yeah, shout out to Cass for that one. You know, I mean? he should expand it on that. Yeah, I, I thought I thought that was dope. <laughs> after a while, then I check the first episode. He rubbed it in his face. Um, my necklace VVS goes froze. Itch hugged me and she and she catch a cold. Please tell me in what part of this round did he beat Hitman Holler? That's all I need from you, ladies and gentlemen. So what's going to happen is everybody that's watching this, that's we really support Cassidy. Shout out to Cassidy. It's, it's not no hate. You know what I mean? I guess, you know, some, I think somebody said this too. Somebody said this. Jay Black, you skip Bayless. Cassidy's LeBron. Okay. Shout out to Cassidy. You know what I mean? The fact that you got the fan base like that, it's, it's fire. I respect that. So I believe I'm going to have two battle rappers on champion throughout, throughout this week. And if they thought you won, I'm going to give them the platform to talk. We can go back and forth. So hopefully that conversation you guys can see. So you'll, you'll have more than one side saying, okay, this person won. Because, you know, when we did champion, I like a back and forth debate. I like a back and forth debate. So we don't have them like, ah. And there wasn't really no room for me to play devil's advocate based on what I got my notes at. So we're going to have two battle ups. I think at least one of them should have Cassidy winning. And we'll talk. We'll talk. All right, I gave the second round of Hitman Holler clear. Respectfully. Gave it to him clear. I don't even see the room to even, I don't see the room at all. You know what I mean? You can't sit there and tell me, oh, he got booed. They both got booed, and Cassie got booed three times as much. I guess you got to wait for him to drop it on YouTube. So that's going to happen. Third round now, y'all ready? Here we go. All right. Before I even go, we're going we to let y'all vote. Cassidy won. Round three. Hit man. Uh. Oh, we gave Cassidy a head start. I have a lot of people in here. Let, let's, let's please run the numbers up. That's what happens. You know, you, you be having the world watching you, but like only a small percentage votes. All right, we, we waiting. Everybody on YouTube, you know, you can also put your votes in the comment section right now. Let's, let's have a, a peaceful debate. We can have that. I don't understand why people are mad. Like, if somebody say, yo, Cassidy won, black. Like, okay. Y'all be, like, mad. I'm like, I'm going to get you. You outside, win. You said he won. Relax. Let's have a civilized debate. We could do that. A little bit of clash, you know what I'm saying? Let's just, I'm breaking down on why I have who I have winning. Cool. All right, with that being said, now we can get a third round from Hitman Holla. Uh, they booed him off rip in the third. Like he he said, yo, and they're like, they pretty much like boo. <laughs> they 
That crowd was different. That crowd was different. Uh, let me see. Uh, 16. Okay, he got to the 16-year-old story I thought was cool. It gave credence to why this battle, why he accepted the battle, why this battle is happening, and why it somewhat makes sense. So I'm not really mad at the 16-year-old situation. But it also confirms what uh, Cassie was saying in his first round. So, But then again, you know, I would say this too. Let's not downplay Cassidy as a hip hop legend. Like, like, I have a story the same way Cassidy has. A, I mean, Hitman Holla got a story. Um, I got a story. I said this too, but you know, uh, we was in Philly, Vernon Road. Uh, Cassidy came to this Jamaican store. Everybody was starstruck, bro. Oh five, like around them times, Cassidy was that man. He was that man. Listen, I'm from Philly. No, Cassidy, le legend over here. He's a legend over here. So we had them stories where niggas was starstruck, you know what I mean, when Cassidy, when he had his hits out, like, yeah, so I'm not even mad at Hitman Holla getting an autograph from Cassidy, like, yeah, you, he, at that point in time, Cassidy was the man. He was so, so much of a man now that he's able to battle off his name and continuously battle off his name over a decade later, so. But you pretty much say, yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna, you know, pretty much beat him in a battle 16 years ago. But then it goes into this: you had a 16-year head start, and I still hawked you down. But I feel like DK Metcalf, that was dope. The way different, way different. Okay. Channel a different kind of energy. Okay. Uh, green, green on Hawk news, news flash. I made 150 thousand on just in just this league. I thought that was fire. The Huster, an easy problem. I can always count on my hands. So that was dope. I thought this segment was dope too. Not every line was hot, but I thought this segment was fire to me. Um, waving a stick. Like I'm trying to cast a spell on this itch. Bullets go, going out so quick. He thought he couldn't tell he was hit. That was cool. He thought he was cool when he tried to walk. And he almost fell on this itch and he performed it. I like the way he delivered and performed that situation. That was dope to me. To whoever think a nine and miss... Don't know who the F I am. Thought that was cool. And I'm seeing, hold on, I'm seeing battle rappers. I'm paying attention to you guys, ladies and gentlemen. I'm seeing battle rappers quoting and tweeting stuff like this. Huh? I checked my Twitter today, ladies and gentlemen. I checked my Twitter today. I'm not on Twitter like that at all. I seen y'all. I want to see them same people that be critiquing lines heavily. To the last, to the last Adam. Like, oh, he, he misspelled this word. He put an S at the end. Why y'all not doing that for the, never mind. We're going to leave that, we're going to leave that there. We're going to leave that there for two seconds. We're going to leave that there for two seconds. Just saying. Um, either Anonymous was cool. Uh, I turned the face off in the karaoke night was cool. The Gilly angle, he could have did more with that. He could have did more with that. But I I accepted it. But it went into the ah oh, shit. Any time now, Cash should be approaching him. He could have went into that little you know little crazier too. But he said ah oh, shit. Any time now, Cash he should be apologizing. Then it went to the AR ad book straight. And I think this is where he closes out the round in a pretty good fashion. To me, he brings out the goat, the only person in battle right to be undefeated. I thought Jack and Jay lost a few battles. That's just me, though. I'm not a hater. I don't hate Jack and Jay. I don't hate Jack and Jay. We're not going to do that. I don't hate Jack and Jay, ladies and gentlemen. I don't hate Jack and Jay. I'm just calling it like I said. But show out is undefeated in battle rap. Every time that man brother touch the stages, he wins. He carries home the win for the team. So show out the GOAT comes out. And he pretty much ends off But I got the tray. I'll make him sit down. F it. Let's dine in. Dope. Dope. Good segment. Could remix that as well. That's just me. That's just my opinion. You know, you guys are the experts, battle rappers. Cassidy, Hitman Holly, y'all the experts. Um, and it went to they laugh at my passion and emotion. But all that equal, all that ish equals wealth. You wanna know why Nick Cannon not don't be in my battles, nigga? It's nigga, you can ask him yourself. He brings out Nick Cannon. I thought that was fire to me. I like the fact that he he he's 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 rebuttaling in a sense what Cassidy was saying. I thought that was dope. Asking yourself. But I guess in this new wave of battle rap, this new round that we're in, <laughs> that doesn't matter. 
It's trash. You know, but when uh, how the Don brings out Calico's dad in the third round. Oh, never mind. Anywho, it's there's different rules today. It's different rules today. But I thought Hitman Holler had a third a dope third round. Um, it was on par with his first, and he, he added in his you know his theatrics in the third. Good third round from him and Holler. Um, Cassie third round now. Here we go. Here we go. Don't call me a hitter by reading lines. Oh, the security situation. I'm not really. That's not really battle rap, so I'm not really gonna expand on the security situation. I thought his security did a good job. At the end of the day, Cassidy is an industry artist worth a good amount of bread. They protect in the bag. I get it. I'm not mad at it. You know what I mean? I'm not mad at it. So I think that was supposed to happen. You know, them putting Cassie in the background. And I think they literally, so I don't think Cassie ran to the back. If you watch it back, I watched it three times, ladies and gentlemen. Cassie's being pulled back. Cassie's trying to move to the front. But he got like five hands on him like this. That's literally pushing him to the background. Like, no, Cassie, we're not doing that. We're here for you. We're here for a reason. Let's do our job. So I'm not mad at Cassie at all for the security situation. They did what they're supposed to do. It is what it is. Shout out to Cass. They did their job. Shout out to security. If I make it security, I will hire you, brother. You know, put his IG up or something. That security did not move an inch. I apologize again. If anybody should have made the front cover, it was that security guard. That security. You, you mean to tell me? I've watched scuffles on stage almost a decade now. Being at events, watching online. Everybody's moving like this. Oh, man, it's too much people. This security guard is like this the whole time. This is hands being put on. He just standing still. Superman could have came in and flew. Bow! He'd be like this. So I apologize. That security guard should have made the front cover, ladies and gentlemen. I apologize. That security guard needed to be on the front cover. Champion, what are you doing? Get it right, champion. All right, Cassie, third round. This is a full breakdown and recap of the battle. Review, pardon, I didn't recap. It's a review. It's a different. We're going through everything. Even though there's shit in my jeans, I get a lot of slack. Shout out to Mickey Facts. I, just, I, I can't wait to hear your opinion on this one. I had the most respect for Mickey Fax. Like, really, I'm not even sure I got, though. I just want to see Mickey Fax uh, break down the battle, you know, or his take on the situation. I just want to see it. Um, Would rapper beat a homicide but not a rat? I thought that was dope. I thought that was dope. I was the shit before daylight tried to shit on the floor. Nah. Your name hit, man, but you never wrote a hit before. It's third round, ladies and gentlemen. This is the third round. Right, and everybody trying to pressure me, you know, kill on black, black, you bugging black, you bugging black. I send them my opinion. Um, you never you never did shit before, but worked for Nick before. I think that was dope, but he could have set it up better. That's just me though. That's just me though. I thought that was dope though. Shot the cast for that line. Uh the clip be sticking out like Florida do. My shirt worth like 600, but his is thrift, thrift storable. Cool. I ain't mad at that. And he floss on him. I got the bread and this is what I am. the bag. I, I take that. Ain't no, 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 Miss Marla. Ain't no stop now. Ain't they, they lit me up. They lit me up. I'm here to stand on my opinion. Let me, let me go through the lines. He said thrift storable. Respect. That's what he said. I'm, I'm quoting what he said. Here we go. Shout out to Cassidy for this one. Think about it. When Cassidy got it right, he got it right. He got it right. And I think if he had this in the third, he should have removed everything he had in the second regarding this line. Why would a hit man holler? They move in silence. And here's the thing. I, 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 I thought I can do it because, you know, I, you know, Quarter Labs doesn't like me. Shout out to Quarter Labs. Y'all hate my guts. But I think somebody should do this. Just piece together every hot Cassidy line. 
and then give it to Cass. Like, here you go, Cass. You could make Cassie look amazing within these three rounds. So that just shows him, like, yo, if you filter, if you filter, like, what needs to be there and what needs to not be there, you will be fire. Out of these three rounds, you can piece together a perfect Cassidy round. It looks really good. Come fly with, come fly with. I'm literally quoting damn every line that they said in the battle, bro. I'm quoting them in every line they said in the battle. Like, if you watch the battle, you can stop and pause. I'm quoting them in every line. If I, if I missed a few bars from Cass, I missed a few bars from Hitman as well. I've named a few Hitman, bad Hitman, uh, Hitman bars as well. Go ahead and watch the battle and come back to me. All right. Yeah, like I said, why would a Hitman movement? And then here's the thing I think y'all are missing. I, I'm, I'm, I'm quoting the ending punch. Because if I quoted exactly what they said, like to a T, the battle was one hour long. We'd be here for three hours. That's how I do things. All right? So I had to quote just the end of the line. Like I said, why would a hitman holler? They move in silence. That was crazy to me. Uh, the red cross, two reds cross. Don't cross the line at old red cross. That was cool. I get it. It made sense. I do got stage performance. On stage, I performed like every damn where. The crowd boo. Um, I wasn't crazy about the line either. I air drums, but I beat you to death like a man that can't hear. I thought that was cool. Um, let me see here. You could clearly get some shots. You could clearly get some shots like you had some tequila in you. Nah. If a ball head hits your ball head, that's a triple entendre. Okay. Uh, my itch cook ease like Lucius wife. I thought that was dope. I thought that was dope. Um, let me see here. The us see you get beat and that people can see it like only fans. X. Let's say that. Uh, I'm gonna algorithm, you know what I mean? It is what it is. The crowd booed that. Um Bill Collector not again. Okay. That's it. That's the battle, ladies. That's the battle. I gave Hitman Holler the second and third clearly. If we can have fun and debate the first all y'all want, but I gave Hitman Holler the second and third clear as day. Second and third clear. We can have a you can have a fun classy debate about the first if y'all want. I'll even give you cast the first. This battle was second and third clear, and it gets worse on every watch back in terms of who I'm picking. And the first of all, the Atlanta crowd, I see I got a little flack for that. Atlanta crowd. When I said the Atlanta crowd is gonna boo, I was making that assessment off of history. Resolution, they booed. Genesis, they booed. John John versus Ace Amin, they booed. So I'm going off of them booing the last couple times in Atlanta. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. So respectfully, I'm just saying what, what usually happens. And that's no diss to Atlanta. You know what I mean? I like the difficulty. I like the difficulty. I, you know, I, I said in the past that I want, I want to get the boo. I said I would like the first boo. The boo in every round, every before they can even finish the setup, like, come on, that's 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 kind of crazy. I think you're supposed to boo at the end. Let's, let's say a person like they 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 rap right. And then the gun go ha 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 bow, and look at y'all. That's when you boo. Like, oh, that wasn't hard. But if they go the boo, he's in the middle of a setup. Why are you booing the setups? He didn't get to the punchline yet or the ending scheme. I'm just, come on, y'all don't, y'all don't boot it. Y'all don't boot it in the middle of the shits. But, you know, real shit, though, shout out to Cassidy and Hitman Holla. I was thoroughly entertained with the battle. Shout out to RBE. I was thoroughly entertained with the battle. I had fun with it. You know what I mean? I think that's what we can expect going forward in Cassidy's next battle. Hitman Holla, you did not, I repeat, you did not, you know, your name is Hitman Holler. Cassidy's not dead. Cassidy's alive and breathing. And I think because the war, we only said the war. Cassidy won the war. He won the war. Once, once you set out the goal to be, oh, uh, he's never going to be booked again. And he's going to get booked again. He wins. I think that's what it is. 
So there's a curve there. There's a curve there. And the battle rapper set it up. Y'all keep saying he's that bad, he's that bad, he's that bad. Okay, we expect the world from you and nothing from him. And we get something from him and we get half the world from you. What things are you going to say? It is what it is, though. Ladies and gentlemen, that's my assessment on the battle. Cassidy versus Hitman Holler. We will be breaking down the rest of the battles. Um, so Rosenberg Raw versus Show Off, Pulverize. We're going to get to that in detail. Either I can do a quick recap on that or a detailed one. I'd rather do a detailed situation. You know what I mean? Because Show was good in the first round. We won't get into the you know everything that happened within that battle. So stay tuned for that. Ladies and gentlemen, that is my Cassidy versus Hitman Holla breakdown and review. We're going to be reviewing it one more time. I think if one of the battle rappers have him winning, we're going to see what they say. I got two battle rap guests coming this week. And if they have him winning, we'll talk again. We'll have him shut me up. Black, what you talking about? Okay. Good luck on that debate, though. Good luck. With that being said, champion.